Hi, this is Amy M. Burns from amyamburns.com and this is a quick video to show you one great tip about Canva if you haven't discovered this or don't use Canva much. So first of all, Canva for Education is a free version of Canva that has more than the regular free version. Um, it actually has a lot of different um, items from the professional paid version. So if you are an educator, educator, excuse me, and you haven't signed up for canva.com forward slash education using your educator's email address, I highly suggest you do that because if you can get Canva for education for free, it gives you a lot of different options, templates, and other things that you can use so wonderfully in your classroom to create posters, manipulatives, or what I'm going to talk about today, programs. So my elementary music students in our conservatory had their recitals this week, so I needed to make a concert program. But I didn't want to take too much time, so I went to Canva, put in create a design, and put in concert program. It gave me a lot of different choices and templates that already were there for you. So I decided to use the first time, I decided to use Rhapsody in Blue. What this has already for you is a template with the text boxes already grouped for you and built in. For you to change this, all you have to do is double click in and change around using your items instead of theirs. So your dates, your titles, your composers, your ensemble. As I look at this, even if I wanted to make these text boxes longer, all I have to do is ungroup them and that separates out the text box. I would highly encourage you to group it back so that you can move these around all as a set. So if I move them around, my issue is I always try and try to line them up with the lines that you see, but I never quite get it right. It might be trying to line it up at the end, it might be trying to line it up in the center, and you'll notice that even the little boxes with the numbers come up to help me out. And because I have more songs than, uh, that's listed on this template, I have to copy and paste and then, of course, adapt these to what I want. So I end up looking at something like this, and I'm still not getting it right. And what can I do? So what I can do is I can select all using Command-A on a Mac or Control-A on a PC or Chromebook. And then go up to here, now that I've selected all, go up to position and click tidy up. When I tidy up, it tidies up everything on that page. And because I tidied up, let me just select it all again, position, it uh, did it towards the center. So it looks really good. So I don't have to worry about trying to align things. I love this tip. It's very intuitive. It's just select all, position, tidy up. Even if I go to a different template with the side here. Now if you look at it, this little sidebar is actually on a portion of this page that you can't see. So again, I have things all over the place. And not all of these are grouped. So I would go through these and group them. But for something like this, where this part of the template is sitting off the page, I will have to actually manually click by using the shift key to get all of these boxes selected. However, I can tidy it up again by going to position, tidy up, but this time I'm going to put them to the left. When I do that, then it's going to match up with this bar. Maybe the intermission, I might go and position that back to the center. And maybe this Mozart, I would have grouped it so that it would line up correctly. So that's very important to group your text boxes when you're going to use the position to tidy it up. But that tidy up is phenomenal. Want to learn more? Check out Midnight Music with Katie Wardrobe. She did an April webinar and you can find it on the Midnight Music YouTube channel, Five Fantastic Design Teachers Can Create with Canva. Or if you want to do your own online PD with her, she did a Canva Beautiful te uh, Create Beautiful Teaching Resources with Canva, which is fabulous. Or if you're part of New Jersey um, Association for Independent Schools, like I am, 
I am going to be a part of their Innovation and Collaboration Conference this August, and I will be presenting on Canva. So join me there if you're in New Jersey, a part of the NJAIS um, organization. Well, I hope that little tool of just position and alignment, or position and tidy up will, and just aligning everything, helped you out today. Check back weekly and subscribe and like my channel.